On this episode, I built a massive mansion in hardcore Minecraft, filled with awesome features like a basketball court, a tennis court, a outdoor swimming pool, and even a helicopter pad, and many more. So the first thing I need to do is find a spot to build this giant mansion. And uh, there's not a lot of space in my world, but I'm seeing a pretty nice area right here. And bam, there we go. Now, the next thing I need to do is terraform all of this land because people who live in mansions just have better looking land. Like their grass just looks richer and they probably spend like six million dollars to keep their grass nicely cut so let's move out this entire area that took me two full hours to do yeah but now let's start collecting the materials i need to build this mansion and it's gonna be a lot of it but we already have a bunch of jungle wood well bam we also have unlimited sand that we can turn into sandstone but we're gonna need more things like blackstone how did you get in here oh my Oh, let's just come up here and uh, grab it from here so I don't get attacked. And we also need some andesite for this project. So let's come here and grab a bunch of... Oh. And lastly, I need some birch trees or birch wood to be more specific. Because I can't build a house out of a tree. I need the wood. Why am I so awkward, man? And now that we have all of the materials that we need, let me tell you guys the game plan. So obviously the mansion is going to be built right there and it's going to look super cool. But to make this even cooler, I'm going to be adding some super cool features to this mansion. Like a giant fountain in the front, a swimming pool, a basketball court, and a tennis court in the backyard. Some palm trees, some supercars, and maybe a helicopter. So this is going to be pretty fun. Let's work on the frame of this mansion. And on this end right here, there will be a spiral staircase that leads up to the top of it. Kind of like that. Now let's build an entire frame for the size of this entire mansion and see how big we're going to build it. And now let's build up the foundation. All right, it's not looking too bad so far. Now looking at it, I feel like my chest room is way bigger than this mansion I'm going to build, which is... uh wasn't the plan but this is still gonna look awesome so now let's start working on this staircase let's come and grab some spruce stairs and some slabs which this part won't be enough there we go now let's build the stairs and now the entire floor and now let's come to the backyard here start laying down some foundation for the cool features like a basketball court hopefully that'll be big enough um i'm not sure why i used leaves to outline it yep that's much better now right beside it uh let's build a tennis court right here and i'll spice these up later in the video but it's gonna look pretty cool and right against this stone wall let's build the outline for a two-story outdoor swimming pool Hey, there we go. And later on in the video, I'll be building a lazy river inside the cave. I also built the frame for other cool features like a front water fountain and a helicopter pad. Finally, it's time to start working on the actual mansion. So let's take some jungle wood and I'm really surprised I'm building with jungle wood. Look at this. This almost makes me want to throw up. But I have a plan to mix up the jungle planks with some stripped birch logs and some smooth sandstone to make a cool looking combo. So first things first, I want to make a pretty grand entrance. So let's make it a circle as well to match with this thing and let's build it up now let's add some birch wood this will be the main block frame of the mansion like the support stuff and let's strip them down now let's get five blocks and build up the next support beam thingy wood and this will be the size of one of the walls now let's bring out the wall one block so the mansion just looks bigger and continue this all the way around this entire outline now let's simply connect up all of these pillars with some more birch logs and strip them again and do this all the way around. Uh, and I just ran out of birch logs. Why didn't I bring more? Ugh. Snatch all that. And let's come right back. Oh. Let's come right here and what the? Let's come here. and Okay, I made it. Oh, if I miss this, I'm going to pop a vein in my forehead. Oh, nice. Nice. Ah, it's like, oh my God, I actually fell. <laughs> so the mansion is looking pretty big so far, and we're not even halfway done because I still got to build a second floor. Oh, yeah. Let's just uh, run over here and bam. Isn't editing pretty cool? So now that the entire frame is basically built out. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, my God. 
It's a whole army. Did you see how much knockback it just took? The next step for this mansion building is to build the frame for the rooftop because that is very important. And I'm thinking of building it out of black stone. So let's turn these into slabs. Let's just come up with a general shape and see how it looks. So this is the basic design I came out with, but I'll probably end up rolling with the same design all throughout this entire mansion. So let's leave that till later and start working on these walls. And it's gonna be pretty simple, just some jungle wood. And I might mix in some jungle logs and strip them kind of like this to add a little bit more texture. And the windowsill will be right here with stairs coming out like th oh, like this. Nope, not like that. Like this. Okay, I kind of don't like that. <laughs> How about some sandstone to replace it? I think that looks better, but up close, it's pretty ugly. If you fly far away, though, and look back, you won't even notice a thing. So let's just stick with this design and bring it all the way around this mansion. And later on, we're going to add small little details to the walls to spice it up a little bit. But I'm tired, so uh, let's go to sleep. Bruh. What is going down down here? Oh my... This is literally the best creeper farm ever. Why is it always creepers? Please, please. Oh, oh my God. I'm gonna just uh, snatch my bed. Don't mind me and sleep over here. Are you Okay, well, that's basically the entire front side complete. And that took me a pretty long time. And I still have all of this to do. Oh my god. Now we just need to finish the second floor. So we just do a quick spin and we're done. That was a very weird noise I made. Um, I actually make a lot of weird noises, but it's looking pretty boring right now. It's basically the same exact windows. Just copy and paste it all. <laughs> all over the house oh man but once we start adding some detail and a rooftop this will look amazing you just have to trust me please just trust me Ow. but now let's start finishing up this rooftop and this is a pretty complex design with sandstone a birch border and blackstone at the top it's uh it's hard but it looks really good so let's grab all of the materials and let's first start off with the birch border that goes all the way around the mansion and oh why is minecrafting so hard like i cannot walk in a straight line and there we go oh my god on the very last block i fell and now for the sandstone it goes stairs slab stairs slab stairs slab all the way down and i'm hoping it will be even right here if i built this correctly and i barely do anything in life correctly so. hey yo so far so good i'm actually doing something right for once mom she's gonna be so proud of me building things right on minecraft is such a huge accomplishment in life and there we go but now it's for the painful part let's take all this black stone and turn it into slabs and now that we have a full inventory let's finish up this entire ceiling Yep, now it's starting to look like a mansion. It's pretty awesome. Now we just need to fill in these windows. That was like a cool Spider-Man move. <laughs> but let's go grab some glass. Oh, 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 And I'm thinking on just using some white stained glass panes because it just looks cooler. And it saves on a lot of materials not using full glass blocks because I'm just cheap like that. So let's fill in this first front wall and see what it looks like. And hey, that's not bad. I feel like that's the best choice of glass. Well, let's start filling up all the glass paints. <laughs> Why do I... What? Why do I make those noises? It's just like instinct, you know? <laughs> that was sick. Definitely not my first try. I mean, I mean, definitely my first try. It's just like in instinct, you know? It's just like inks. It's just like. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> what does that look like to you guys? <laughs> that's a really, that's really thin.
All right, the mansion is looking pretty good so far. All of the windows are in and let's just fly through here out. and also in the back. Oh, wait, I, I forgot to build the rooftop here, bro. There we go. Now let's spice up the build by adding some finer details to the windows and the walls. Let's grab some stone brick walls, some item frames, some lanterns. Let's craft a bunch of anvils and let's start. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, where'd you come from? Where's your dad? Ugh, I'm your dad now. <laughs> and we also need some birch stuff, which I'm out of birch. Nice. Let's head over to the birch forest. Sorry, I'm a, I'm a little impatient. <laughs> and let's collect up a bunch of birch trees. Oh, ow. Uh, let's turn these all into planks and then let's make some trap doors. We're going to need a lot of this because I'm going to put them all over the house. So to spice up this build a little bit, I'm going to be putting trap doors on these logs, but like every second block. And I have a feeling it's going to make it look a little better. I hope Um, no, no promises at all. Let's quickly do it on the other side and let's see how it looks. Oh my God. Jeez, that adds a lot to the build. Look, compare that side to this side. Let's also put it on this giant window over here. I feel like it will look good. And over on this side. Oh, yeah. I love those trap doors. They're quite exquisite, if I do say so myself. I'm literally the weirdest person ever. But now let's take some lanterns and some stone brick walls and start adding some lights to this build. What if that... How does that look? Hmm, that's not too bad. Yeah, I think it's a pretty good addition to add. And if your mansion doesn't have 16 million lights turned on all night, then is it even a mansion? And now, actually, I do need these trap doors. I want to add some more window pane looking things. I'm not quite sure how to do it yet. Let's take some sandstone walls and kind of bring this up so it looks like it's an actual windowsill. And now I kind of want to have some dividers like this, maybe. Um, Will this look good? Is it even? Oh, could I put blocks here and trap doors like that if i break this now and i put trap doors on the other side it should look like a very thin divider oh that that that's op that that's so good compared to this to that side jeez man i i'm so weird <laughs> this is oh my god what is going on what what am i how am i placing a block right here what is this minecraft I'm aiming here and it, okay, I swear it was, you know what? I'm not going to talk. I, 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 wow, that, that looks so much better. That, that, that's insane. Oh my God, I got a better idea. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh my God, I'm a legend. Look at that. Jeez, man. And by the way, if you guys didn't know, I'll be uploading all of the BTS funny moments, bloopers, and just funny personal moments all on my second channel for every single hardcore episode you watch. So if you guys want to hear me make weird noises or hear some funny personal stories while I'm making this episode, go to the second channel and subscribe. It'll also be linked in the description below. Wait a sec. No. Whoa, wait a second. Do you guys see something wrong here on the second floor compared to the first floor? Do you guys see anything wrong? Oh, I forgot to add jungle logs to the, the walls. No, I need to. I still need to do that. I don't even have jungle wood. No, why is there zombies now? No way I ran out of jungle wood. <coughs> oh, let's collect some jungle wood. Oh, man. And let's just add a bit of jungle logs all around here and pretend that I didn't forget because like I don't I don't forget anything guys i'm just the smartest man alive i'm walking on this earth now let's grab some birch stairs and let's build the railing up here for the balcony let's do this and continue on this side and meet right in the middle i think is that the middle i don't think that's the middle that's that's the middle right yeah oh that's not bad i just feel like there's too much wood going on let's switch it to stone brick and you might look at this thing and think there's enough detail and it looks pretty good but i still got more ideas to make this look even better and snazzier let's craft some more sandstone let's grab some campfires and let's build a few chimneys on top of this ceiling i think i'm gonna build four and let's just throw a campfire back here and that will be the chimney honestly it's, it's kind of ugly okay from a distance from a distance you can't even tell maybe just a, a little detail with a trap door there yep that works for me now let's build a few more Since we have the big daddy chimneys on the main part of this mansion, I want to build some smaller little ones over here. So I have a pretty good idea. Let's grab some sandstone walls, some birch trap doors, and there's one block I want to use, which is... How the heck do you make a flower pot? Wait, it's clay. I'm so dumb. Do we even have clay? Bruh. Yeet. What the... <laughs> 
That was the weakest firework ever. So for this small chimney, I'm going to put it back here somewhere and it's just going to be thinner. So it'll go up like this. Uh, I'm going to use some birch trap doors instead. And let's hide two campfires in here. And I'm going to put up some sandstone walls like that and flower pots on the top. I feel like that's going to look pretty good. Ooh, that, that's pretty good. Let's build the same exact thing on this side. And the very final touch I want to add to this mansion is a little spike right here here um oh that's a problem let's um break this turn into a full block and do that and just a reminder this is what the mansion looked like at the beginning of the video and this is what it looks like now yeah it, it looks pretty awesome there's just a few little details i need to fix up like filling in these small little triangle things in the roof but now let's move on to the cooler features like the helicopter the basketball and tennis court and the outdoor swimming pool so first things first let's start building the helicopter pad right here i think i'm gonna go with some simple black and white White. and i don't have any black wool um do i have any black concrete I, I have a bit so let's fill up this entire circle and right in the middle there will be a nice little h like that perfect all right let's slap down the h right in the middle here just like okay <laughs> it should probably be a little bit bigger Yep, there we go. So now let's start building the helicopter. Okay, I think I got all the materials I need. I haven't really built a helicopter before, so this might go very bad. So let's make some walls and this will act as the wheels of the helicopter, I guess. <laughs> so my plan is to have the helicopter all white. So let's give it a little nose like that. Let's take some iron trap doors and put it at the bottom of this. Let's make a little wing kind of like this and let's put some trap doors here to thin it out a bit i guess let's bring this up um this will be the body of the plane in here let's throw in like a window here i guess I, I literally have no idea what i'm doing guys but let's just make more windows let's now switch it out with some black stone and make it the cockpit um maybe a thing like that and let's smooth it out okay that, that's not looking too bad right guys like it's not terrible let's just continue building and see how it looks at the end Hey, it's not looking too bad so far. Come on. It, it, it looks like a volcano. What? Not a volcano. It looks like a helicopter. But now all we gotta do is build the propellers at the top. I already made a little baby daddy version right here at the fin or the back. Now we just gotta design this top part. And just a small detail, I'm gonna replace this bottom support beam thingy for the propeller with some black stone. It looks more tough. You know what I mean? And now my helicopter is complete. Yo! Yo! Guys, I think we did something here. Maybe just some trap doors here for like some armor protection. I don't know. And that's a pretty sick helicopter, guys. What do you guys think? Drop some ratings in the comments because I really like this. Now onto the next cool feature, which is going to be the basketball court right here. So I'm going to use a different white than the uh, out of bounds area. So I'm going to go with some snow blocks. Let's make the three point line kind of just bulge out like uh, this. Um, Yeah, I think that's a good size. And now for the paint on the inside, let's go for a red and orange right in the middle with another red line like that. And I forgot my oak blocks bro let's grab a lot of these and let's fill in the floor and only rich people have wooden basketball courts outside like come on we can't go with some boring old peasant tree concrete let's repeat the same thing on the other side but now let's start building the basketball net oh come on now come on now that is sick now let's build this side and there we go but there's just one more thing i want to add to these basketball nets and that is some cobwebs bam and let's grab some more just for the tennis court Oh, oh, where's my axe? Go oh, away. Uh. And now if I put a cobweb in here, it'll look like the net. Maybe, maybe down there. Um, let's let's remove that. Yeah, I, I like that. Bam. And there's my awesome outdoor basketball court. And now for the tennis court. So I don't really play a lot of tennis, but I'm pretty sure the courts are green. Oh, nice. I do have green concrete. Nice. Let's come down over here. And this should be pretty simple. Let's replace it with some snow blocks right there. And let's... I think there's a a border like this i i don't know the fans that play tennis will be kind of mad at me and i think i just fill this in with lime concrete there we go let's take some white concrete put it there and take my cobwebs and make the net yup there we go my tennis court is done <laughs> i think that's all you need right it looks it looks like a tennis court i am a bigger fan of basketball though so um how, how did i get stuck bro what is <laughs> what is going on with me
Okay, that was so weird. Um, yeah, that was your fault. But there we have it. We have a tennis court and a basketball court all built out in the backyard. Something that only rich people have. So none of us will ever see this. And if you do have a basketball court in your backyard, uh, hit me up please next all right next up let's start working on this double layered waterfall thingy pool um swimming pool and i feel like this is gonna be pretty cool because it's right on the edge of this cliff and that gives me pretty good ideas so the bottom of the swimming pool will be made out of quartz because it just looks a lot cleaner so let's grab that and start laying it down so this top section of the swimming pool will be more of a shallow kitty swimming pool but down here will be the deep end the big daddy version where all the cool kids will hang out so let's fill up this floor and i already ran out of quartz nice i can never have anything i want in life i'm gonna bring it down just a notch very subtly with some slabs i'll bring it all the way here and i'll have a spiral into the deep end i don't know what's up with me and spirals lately but yeah i've been liking spirals i guess Okay, now all I gotta do is fill it up with some water. All right, it's going down to the second step, and oh god, I think I think I'm a little too short for this pool. I, I'm about to drown. <laughs> yeah, I think this side's gonna be a little too deep for me. I'll stick to the kiddie pool, but I don't really know what's the best way to fill up this pool. I can't really place a block, so I think I just gotta spam water until it works. Oh my god, it's actually working. I'm a genius. I never questioned myself ever in my life. I knew exactly what I was doing, and the pool is done. Oh my, okay. I thought I was going <laughs> to drown. Look how funny this looks. It's just my head popping off the water. Let me take take off some clothes here. Ah, we're just chilling in the pool. Just me. Um, yeah, I might need some company. I got no friends though. So, um, what, what could I do? I got me some chickens. <laughs> yeah. All right, come down. Join me in the pool. Yes. I got me some friends. Now make some babies in the water. Oh my God. And there we go. And now let's just extend this floor beside the swimming pool. Now that gives me some room to build some lawn chairs so I can just like sit right here and relax and be lonely. Oh man, what do I remind myself every day? <laughs> and let's come down here to grab some random wool colors. Let's turn them into carpets and let's start building some umbrellas for these lounge chairs. And yeah, that's a really ugly umbrella. What if I replace this with... Oh no, I didn't think it would break. Let me just put a stone brick wall right here right here right 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 here right here i trapped myself in somehow how did i trap myself okay uh, okay i'm struggling oh my and it's still just as ugly yeah I i'm gonna go sleep my pain away <laughs> you know what let's build another ugly umbrella over here okay the dual ugly umbrellas um perfect <laughs> and now let's start working on something fun let's build a few diving boards off of this cliff because you know why not let's put some stairs here and some slabs like that a ladder and yay okay yeah we, we didn't have to add that sound effect um that that was that was so offensive but uh <laughs> let's build another one over here like this and there we go and there's one more thing i need to add and that is the lazy river that goes into this cave and pops out on the other side let's just make the tunnel but now since we got the lazy river let's put some lanterns in here to make it like a little bit spooky with some nice lighting if that makes sense and there we go we got ourselves a lazy river i can't believe i just made it all the way around <laughs> just banged on my head on every stone wall now that the entire backyard is complete and looks super awesome let's work on some decoration at the front of the house which is going to be this fountain right here i don't want to make it too tall because it'll block the beautiful mansion so it's just gonna be like a little one let's use some andesite i think that'll be a good uh block and some quartz so let's remove this red border we have here and let's replace it with some stairs like that i think that'll be all right there we go. And to make it even fancier, let's put some slabs um, just scattered around like this. Let's now come up here and grab some spruce wood. And let's replace this floor with some planks to add some color. And now let's start working on this fountain. Let's make it super fancy, but still kind of small. That relates to a lot of things in my life. <laughs> not, the, not the fancy part, just the small part. <clears throat> 
Anyways, and I also want some water to pour through this bottom part here. So let's first fill this up so I know what I'm working with. And I already ran out of slabs. Nice. Bam! And these aren't even the right slabs, bruh. What? What slabs are these? Port slabs? I, I made smooth slab, bruh. No one could even tell a difference, right? Like, if you just... Yeah, fine. I'll go get some quartz slabs, bruh. Okay, there we go. That makes my heart feel better. <laughs> so now let's make these little uh slab thingies because it just makes you look rich. And water is going to pour off of these little uh entrances thing. And let's also have it pour out like right uh, here. I think it would look kind of cool. Let's add some more stairs and one more little peak like that. And that's where the water will come out of. Hopefully this turns out nice. Let's land right here and let's put the water down please look good okay um it went through there which is good but i need to go through these holes first so let's block these off and make it spread and please look nice oh that's not that's not bad that's not bad let's go from the far and yep I'll take it. That looks pretty fancy to me. But the final thing we need to finish with this mansion is this entrance right here. It's still empty somehow. I forgot about it. So let's remove this right here and kind of redesign it a little bit. Let's have the door protrude out just slightly, like two blocks, and put some stick. Wow, those, th those stairs are really ugly now. What the heck? Could you make smooth stairs? Okay, that is a lot nicer. These are really ugly. So let's put some stairs like that. Let's build this up slightly like this. And let's bring around a ring of stairs kind of upside down. Let's put some slabs right here underneath it. Let's bring it all around. Let's just smooth out these corners here by adding a few slabs like this. Even some like that to give it a nice arc. And we got ourselves a pretty nice entrance. The the very last thing I want to do is build some pillars that lead up to a balcony up there to act as some support beams. And you can't forget trap doors. And that is the entirety of the mansion complete. The front looks so beautiful and even the backyard is full of cool things. Like a basketball court, a tennis court, a swimming pool, and even a helicopter pad on the side. But there's just one thing missing. The inside is empty. Well, looks like you just gotta wait until next episode.